My name is the Grapefruit Punk. I go by G-Punk. Uh, I have an emotional connection with grapefruits. A couple years ago, I just was eating a lot of grapefruits and really enjoyed how, like eating them whole and carrying them around in my backpack. And when I would eat them whole, I would like rip them to shreds and it was really savage and I would do it in public and like juice would run down my arms. And uh, it just sort of felt like eating my heart in a way um, and I just like created this whole metaphor in my brain that my heart is a grapefruit and now it's both a metaphor but I actually believe it and that's like the way that I understand my heart and my emotions. Um, tell me about your outfit because you've got these this sort of elephant <laughs> pattern on a, um, on a dress. Well I love fashion and <laughs> um, you're a very fashionista. <laughs> I I'm an artist and like I love just aesthetic in terms of anything really and one of my favorite things is just to like choose the aesthetic of the way that I look or the way that I dress not in like a bougie way I don't know I really struggle with the fact that I don't like owning things and I'm a simple person I think here I am backpacking exactly this dress is my summit dress um, and I used to only wear it on special occasions when I was summiting mountains but I brought it on the PCT and wear it Quite often, sometimes I don't. You know, when we met, um, when when we met at this at this little uh, creek campsite here, um, you asked me, "Are you hiking the whole PCT? Are you mm. hell bent?" Is the word <laughs> that you used to hike the whole thing? And I, you know, I was like, "Well, I don't know, maybe I suppose so." And then I asked you, I said, "Are you hell bent on it?" And uh, and you had an interesting response, and I I really want you to share that. Yeah. Um... I think before I started the trail, I was, I was hell bent on it. And, uh, I was very anxious before I started anxious. I couldn't do day one anxious. I couldn't do day two. And just like, felt like there was so much pressure that I guess I had built up in my own brain about getting all the way it was the only way to do it. Um, but since I've been on trail, I've met some people that are not planning on doing the, or from the beginning or not planning on doing the whole thing because they have like to go back to school. And another one of my friends really misses her community that she left and is sort of questioning like why she's out here alone when she could be with people she loves. And like that is coming to fruition as things that matter to her. And so for me, I think just being around people with different perspectives has changed my perspective. And I'm I'm here until I don't want to be here anymore. Um, and when I, when I feel like I'm done, I'm done. And if that takes me all the way to Mexico, then great. And if it doesn't, great. So you're an artist and you're doing an art project while you're on the PCT. Yeah. Tell me about it. So also before I left for the PCT, I was very stressed about the fact that I, and this is like my whole life, I'm stressed about the fact that I love the outdoors and I love theater slash art and there's not much um, overlap in that. Mm -hmm. And I'm trying to like find that. I take a picture of my naked body once a day in the woods or like in whatever environment. And it's a project about change, um, both with like watching the landscape change and the environment change and then watching me change, watching my hair grow, watching my body change, watching a bruise appear and then disappear. Um, and then also watching like how the project changes. Mm. I don't allow myself to redo the picture, except today I cheated because I fell over the <laughs> picture. <laughs> um, nice. I was like I gotta take another one um, but I it's like a and I don't usually go back and look at the picture huh. um and I don't know what I'm gonna do with them when I'm done but I'm excited for like all the material that I will have awesome yeah. well g-punk thanks so much for talking to me I yeah think thanks are gonna for enjoy interviewing this. me all right